What up, everybody? Mad Viking here. Just got out of the shower. I look clean. Uh, we have a box from High Spots, I believe. Yes, it came today. Uh, I pulled it in before I left the house earlier to grab something to eat. It's very heavy. So it has sparked my interest. It's kind of something clunking around. God, I hope they don't give me another thermos now that I think about it. <laughs> the thermoses are getting old. All right, I think I opened it wrong. So we're gonna start bottom to top. We have Kira Hogan Autograph. Right? Yeah, Kira Hogan. Don't have anything on her, so that's different. That's new. Put her over here. I don't know what this is. It's a book or something. Okay, WWE is definitely... Everybody is clearing out their... Uh, their, uh, I guess, their online shops. This is a... What did they just call it? Superstar activity book, jam-packed full of activities, profiles, puzzles, and much, much more. Create your own superstar 3D frame inside. So this is obviously something from the WWE. It's fairly thick. We got, wow, CM Punk. How do they get away with still using him? Oh, what? Because, they, yeah, they control your likeness until the end of time. There's Mysterio. How okay? Maybe this is old because that is old looking CM Punk. Two thousand nine, not old looking, but I mean from that era, two thousand nine. All right, wow. So they had this laying around in a warehouse somewhere and sold it to high spots. Uh, there's crosswords in here. How many times has Shawn Michaels appeared at WrestleMania? There's quizzes. <laughs> and there's JTG. Dila was still there. God dang, that doesn't even sound right in 09. All right, we got Santino. I kind of miss him. All right, we got a coloring whatever. I don't know if that's supposed to be Lita. That's the only one I can look at and guess who that's supposed to be. And Victoria, maybe? I don't know. God, was she in the, I guess she would have been in 2009. But D-Lo was still around in 09? I, I don't believe it. Oh, God, Paul Birchall. <laughs> Holy shit, this, this is old. This is some sort of a pop-up. This must be the 3D thing. You can do Punk or Kane. Yeah, here's the box, but that's not very 3D-ish, but whatever. I'll leave that in there. I think um, I'll use this to when I donate the to toys for tots around Christmas. They ask for books and stuff like that. God, there's Carlito. All right. Oh, Kelly Kelly. All right. Anyway, so you got that. Doot, doot, doot. We got a... Koozie Queens of Combat. Don't know who or what that is. If that's a company or a tag team or... Alright, we got... Sorry You're Watching This, hosted by Dan Barry with Simon Gotch. V? Uh, okay. I'm thinking of the Gotch, but whoever the old guy is gotch was that guy don't look old not simon something gotch all right whatever ring of honor field of honor a uh, four-way match elgin versus briscoe versus aj versus adam cole ring of honor tag team championship red dragon versus christopher daniels and kazarian cedric alexander versus ach the Real Last Man, Silas Young versus the Sicilian sociopath, Tommaso Ciampa. This is the second time I've gotten Ciampa on a Ring of Honor DVD, and I do not remember him in Ring of Honor at all. The Decade gives an opportunity. Decade was decent. Rocky Ramiro versus Mike Bennett. Brutal Burgers. Cheeseburger and Brutal Bob. I do not remember that. Moose and R.D. Evans with Veda Scott and Ramon. Takati Watanabe versus Mike Briscoe, Jay Lethal versus the HOT versus Matt Taven. Scarlett Bardot sings the national anthem. When the hell was this? She was in Ring of Honor? 2014. 
Okay. Maybe that's a little too far back for me to remember, but I shit, I would have remembered Scarlet Bardot. All right. So we got a couple cards. We got Next Generation Wrestling, Next Gen TN. I never showed you that cover, did I? All right, not that it, I don't think really anybody matters. I mean, cares, but. Uh, we got Shane Strickland narrowly defends the NGW Championship against Rick Swan in his first singles match after returning to independent wrestling. So there you go. Maybe you can see that a little bit better. That was the front. We got Savannah Evans. Card. There's the front. There's her in the back making someone miserable. There we go. <laughs> okay. Man, what is this? This must this is the reason why the box weighed so much then. Damn, this is a heavy shirt. Alright, we got a old John Cena Hustle Loyalty Respect shirt. <laughs> oh jeez <laughs> it's one of these never give up so you got the you can't see me on the arm which was kind of cool I don't know why they don't do more stuff like that with the wrestlers like they could have had undisputed error shit like that on their shirts I guess this was one of his better ones this is supposed to be like a play on a beer can PBR I believe man this is a heavy shirt founded in 2002 so you got the Hustle, Loyalty, Respect shirt. I don't think I'll ever wear this out, but who knows. <laughs> Put that over here. We got the ROH Field of Honor event from 2014. We got the Sorry You're Watching This DVD with Simon Gotch. You got the Queen of Combat Koozies. Koozie. The two cards I'm not really going back over again. The Activity Book. WWE activity book. Let me see when this came out. Oh, I think I already did that, didn't I? 2009. And then the Kira Hogan autograph. So that is this month's HighSpots.com's box. I know I just made the deadline when I came home from vacation. I saw I could still get it because I had a new debit card or whatever, so my boxes weren't renewing. And that's how I just caught High Spots box too. So that is this month's box. This would be June. Yeah, for June. Uh, got a show on Saturday, ACW, so I'll have stuff for that event. Um, and that should be it for now. Hit like, subscribe, leave a comment, all that good stuff. Uh, and I'll catch you in the next video. Mad Viking out.